Coming up in this video, something most successful people never do. Hey everybody, it's Harry Kalimnius here from thethoughtgym.com, here helping you become that superhuman self that I know that you can be. And in this video, I want to share with you an observation I've made from studying successful people around the world and what most of them don't do. And maybe you shouldn't do it either if you also want to be successful. What I've noticed with many successful people when I've been reading their books, listening to their interviews, watching them on YouTube, whatever it might be, is that almost across the board, many of them don't bother themselves with the news. The news, yes, it's something that I first got exposed to probably around six years ago when I read Tim Ferriss's Four Hour Work Week and he encouraged a 30 day media fast. And I thought that was crazy that you know you wouldn't know what's going on in the world and you know putting your head in the sand and whatever it might be and even now when I tell people that I don't watch the news I don't buy newspapers I get my news really like people if something's big you find out about it um, occasionally I do put the news in terms of uh, a, an app like a BBC app that I sometimes put on in the middle of the day but the key thing is that I don't have the news items first thing in the morning, last thing at night, when your brain is really susceptible to what's going on. And you have all this, what I call, never-ending wasted stress. That's what the news stands for, never-ending wasted stress. Really what you're getting with the news is a snippet of what's going on in the world. The bit that entices people usually. If anything is super important, you find out about it, but think about it. Can you really remember what you read in the newspaper last week or last year? Whereas I can probably tell you what I read last week and last year in a book and what I learned from that. So it's not to say you don't get anything, but you're gonna get enough news, put it this way. You're gonna see people with their newspapers, you're gonna see the, the TV on in like lobbies of apartments and companies that you go to. You don't need to be watching the news, you don't need to be having all of this never ending wasted stress coming into your life. If you don't believe me, if you have a challenge with this, please, Try it out, 30 days, you don't have any news. And then after that, maybe try and compartmentalize it so you just get it maybe 10 minutes, a little snippet in the middle of the day. Now granted, if you need to know certain news for your job, then focus on that. But all of these free newspapers that are telling you what Kim Kardashian was latest up to or some guy doing something which is completely irrelevant to what you're doing in your life, um, then it's probably not worth it. So think about news as really being never ending wasted stress. And think about the fact that most of the successful people, maybe you've studied a lot of them as well, the commonalities, this is what I look for, the patterns. Many, many, many of them are not wasting their time with the news. You can't be happy watching the news and listening to news things all the time. Just get a snippet if you need to on an app or, or on the website, five, 10 minutes in the middle of the day. But other than that, never ending wasted stress you do not want, okay? That is my rant for this week. I know I, I'm going to maybe ruffle a few feathers with this one, so you know I'm open to that. Uh, remember, live your life as you want to live it. I'm living it as I want to live it. I'm just sharing with you what I've observed and what I find really works for me. Do comment below, like, comment, share. I love to hear all the feedback, whatever it might be, and I will see you very soon. So until next time, remember to stay strong, stay super. Bye -bye.